I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Major Key Podcast, we back in the building. Let's get money with the homie Gooba this week, man. Let's get it, man. What's up, homie? What's up with it, man? We out here, man. How was your week, man? Yo, great, man. Network is the best work. This week, man, I was able to finish up a video uh, for Little Roddy on behalf of 317 Marketing and Media. You know, I'll be putting it out shortly. It's a, it's a sponsorship uh, a promo for his uh, for his two uh, singles that came. I mean, two albums that came out. You know, and uh, we we was able to put the billboard up for him. You know, on behalf of 317 Marketing and Media, we moving and moving, moving and grooving, baby. You know, and, and just in case if y'all ain't know, he's from out here. He's from Jersey. Facts, all right? We do got artists out in New York and stuff like that, but he's from Jersey. Facts. So Little support, Roddy, man. salute. Salute to Lil Roddy, man. Also, man, the flight's on. You know, we did the show live uh, again from New York this Tuesday. You know, we definitely put on. Shouts to Miss Info. Shouts to Ladama O. They was holding everything down or holding everything up on behalf, you know, on, on, on the other side of the camera, on the other side nice, of the nice. microphone. Yeah. <laughs> it was a great show, man. Great show. We did good. We, good. we did good out there, man. Yeah. We was holding it down. We had a few holding complications. Holding up. Holding up. Holding up. We had a few um, little, little mess. Um, technical difficulties. Technical I difficulties. But yeah. we got it back together. We bounced back. We came back harder than ever, like always. You yeah. know, we bounced back. We don't, we don't just stop. We bounce right. back. See, this is the thing about doing live radio, Kuba. When you do live radio, is anything can happen. At any given time, you know, it's, it's one of those things where you got to be ready for that. If you ain't ready for that, it's over. Yeah, you know? it's raw and uncut, man. You, raw and... you mess up, you mess up. Yeah. You just got to bounce back. I love doing that, though, man. I love radio. Just like the podcast. Major Key Podcast. Welcome if you're just logging in. Log on. You know, we, we on Facebook Live right now. We usually, we don't do that, Kuba. If you want to listen to Major Key Podcast, you got to download the Podbean app, you know. Spotify. Or Spotify. We're also on Spotify. We ain't playing no games. This week. Great transition. This week, we're coming into Apple Podcasts, and we're starting our Google Podcasts this week coming up. So y'all so, better be ready for that. All so, platforms- Show the love, so, support, man. Show the love and support. Facts, man. We, we're on all platforms. We're trying to- Not trying. We're working towards, you know, just, just taking over the world. PMG LLC. We're not stopping. Everything's, everything's uh, um, you know, it, it's on up and up. We're coming. We're coming, man. Let's get money. Let's so go. Major Geek Podcast, another week, Kuba. You know, it, it's always it's a pleasure, you know, to have you- it's part, not have you, because you are PMG LLC. You started, like we talked last week when, when, uh, when you came on, you know, you started from the beginning, right? Yeah, like, yeah. So You've been it, here, bro. Yeah, man. So when we put this together, it was, it was all brotherhood. It was love, and, 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 and we taking it to the top. Struggles, so, struggles, up and downs, the arguments, the disagreements, but we got it together. Facts, facts. That's how family is, though. That's how was how your week, is. by the way, man? Oh, man, it was a blessing, man. Blessing. We had a great baby shower, you know. Yo, oh, hold excited. up, hold up. Oh, <laughs> shouts to Kuba and shouts to, you know, his other half, his better half. You know, expecting love you, my a baby. Love. Yeah, yeah man. baby boy, man. They're having you know? a baby boy together, Be man. My fifth kid, you know what I mean? So. Yeah, you got a football team. Oh, basketball team. Oh, basketball team. Yeah, you know, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what's up, man. I, I was able to, you know, to be a part of that baby shower as well, you know, and 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 that just bro, man. Yeah, so facts. It's just a special salute one, to you. Know I mean, I've been with her for about eleven years, you know, yeah. and um, my first kid with her, so you know, she's excited, you know. Her. Salute. So thank you. Appreciate I wish y'all the best, man. Throughout the pregnancy, you know, she's about to give birth, uh, you know, like a month, right? Like a month. Like, yeah, yeah. We almost do July yeah. 29th, yo. Yeah. So Ooh. salute, you know, great pregnancy. God first, always, you know, everything will work out. Of course, out. of course. And, and, and little little man, I know you're gonna be seeing this one day. I got you. I got yeah. your back forever, man. You still you, working you, on the nephew. name too. We got to. Oh, you ain't got that. the name yet. Not yet uh, man. You got to get the name together. <laughs> I pro- I help you out with that. That's the know? hardest thing, man. That's the yeah. hardest thing. Cause... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to come together on that one. Facts. Yeah, but it's cool. You get it together, man. But yeah, another week, major key podcast. We're gonna like we said, we we're gonna get dip into a little bit of everything, current events, you know, music, obviously, because we, we we PMG LLC Pilot Music Group LLC we're always involved in music. You know that that's something that we have to keep current and keep uh, afloat. You know, it's the pilot. I'm signing my own label. I make moves, man. So the captain, if you ain't hit the captain, go download it, go stream it, go get that right now. Streaming on all platforms, you know, for the money. Also streaming on all platforms. That video, we we did a couple shots on um at the flight zone on the radio the show Tuesday ride, at the Rough Rider station. Yeah, you know? that was love, man. You know, yeah, yeah. That that's definitely going in the video. Hey, those those hey, shots that we got in there. Hey, veg, man. Good luck. Big, big veg. Yo, you did your thing, man. Yeah, salute, I man. Like the way you do your thing, man. Yeah, salute, big veg. Very, very professional, man. That this type of people within this industry, within this business school, I, that I like to deal with people that are professional people that's going to go you know not you don't even got to go to extra limb just match my energy match my focus and match my drive when it comes to uh, you know music or anything that i'm doing you know yeah facts facts you know what i mean um and 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 like he said we're making moves but i feel like the moves he's making are power moves and and you got to respect that on a whole different level yeah facts facts facts. who who, a big veg 
All right, but with the way you oh, moving, us. man. Oh, me? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I appreciate that, man. Moving, oh, yeah, yeah. The way we moving. Keep yeah, yeah. The way we moving. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 not, it's, not, it's not only, you know, it's not about uh, uh, me or just about you. You know, it's about us. Yeah. You know, we're right. definitely making moves, man. And I appreciate you. Like I always say, I appreciate you. I appreciate the whole squad. You know, like down my O. I appreciate Mach. You know, salute the Mach, man. Mach, you know, feel he, better, man. Yeah, he's the homie. Here. He's the homie, man. I appreciate him no all the time. under the weather. So, guys, you know, excuse the absence, but. He's nah, he's, he's, he's not here. absent. He's here. Exactly. He's here. He's here, man. So, yeah, man, another week. Let's get right into it, man. This week, you know, I'm going to start it off. I don't know how to come at this because. Shoot it at me. Listen, Small listen. Go out. He's, go, what's yeah, going on? Facts, so. facts. He, he's, he's a person within hip hop that made some noise. And, you know, he definitely had an impact, impact uh, rather, in hip hop that was, to me, it was official. You know, I, I really uh, I appreciate his time within hip hop and the things that he did. Hurricane Chris, speaking of, you know. Okay. And, and I just seen some news and I just heard some news. He got locked up for murder, bro. He's got a murder charge he's dealing with right now. Uh, but I mean, we from the streets. Right. And, you know, yeah, we gradually got out of it, but um, it depends. You know, if he had to hold it down for his life and, and, and himself. Right. Well, here's the report. I'm going to tell you how it right, is. Break right? that down for me. All right, boom. So they saying he was, first of all, in a stolen car. He shot this dude. He said he supposedly shot this dude out of self-defense. That was his. First of all, you don't say anything. When you speak to, when, 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 you, when they speak to you or when you, you, you're in an investigation, you be, whatever they doing. Yeah, yeah just keep your mouth shut. Keep your mouth, mouth shut. shut and wait for your lawyer. You know, you have rights. You, you, you're you able to say, I don't want to say anything to you guys. The only thing you really got to give them, and you don't have to, but the only thing you, I would suggest giving them because then it can hold you for not having a name is give them your name. That's it. You know, yeah. other than that, I mean, if, if you have ID, you ain't even got to say your name. They match the picture to the name and that's cool. That's it. Fact. You know, but other than that, I wouldn't say anything. So in, in the initial investigate, whatever. If your lawyer's not present, I wouldn't say anything. So his initial reaction or, 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 or you know, in, in, what he said was that he, he shot, he claims that he shot behind self-defense, you know, and, and um, the law enforcement, the, the, you know, the police, they found out something different. You know, first of all, they, he said he was trying to get, get, they were carjacking him. You know, he, he shot the man because they, they thought he was trying to steal his vehicle, his car. Now, the cops going to do their job. This yeah. video round, you know, they're, they're, like right now, we're on video, Major Key Podcast. Let's get money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah let's get it. Like I said, coming soon to Apple Podcast this week, Uba. Right now, we on Podbean. Download the Podbean radio. Um, the down, da, download the Podbean Podcast app right now. You can That's, catch us on there. Catch it on Spotify also. Also on Spotify. Get it, definitely got to get that in. We on major platforms. Real quick, I just seen this picture, man. Why you got to take a, why they got to put a picture up with my Miami Dolphin team on there? Ah, Come the on, Dolphins. Man. Yo, I only know one other man. Dolphin fan. My brother, my little bro. Shouts man. to D. Yo, yeah, what, 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 dude, right, what they got? It? Yeah, yeah, facts. What, what they got up there with the Dolphins? Now they, now they got um, Chief Keith with the Dolphin hat on, man. Put 40, 49ers or something on there. Ah, man. You know, you know what I'm saying? Message Chief Keith? You don't like Chief Keith? Nah, nah, he cool, man. I just saying the hat. Don't nah, go, don't, don't go with go, Don't go down with my hat. But he repping your team, though. Yeah. I mean, I mean, it's cool. He repping. Right. As long as you repping it you strong, that. yeah. What if you have the PMG LLC hat on? We'd have been right. All right. He right, though. <laughs> nah, he, he, he repping your squad, so you right. But going back to Hurricane Chris real quick. Um, so he said, like I said, he, 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 he told initially that he shot in self-defense. All right, boom. Like I said, you're not supposed to say anything. But if that's what you said, that's cool. But now you should keep in mind or be mindful of the fact that you think these cops are not going to do their job, Gubba? There are. Yeah. Of course there are. You know, So they found out that, first of all, the car that he said they were trying to steal from him was stolen. The one he was in. The one he was in. Was you stolen. out here making money, so why is you in a stolen car? Supposedly. Allegedly, he's still making money. Okay. Who knows? I mean, his hits, like, well, we going back, bro. With A. Bay Bay, that was 2007, bro. Right. You know, that was a, a, off his album 5150 Ratchet. So that was a minute ago. That's why you should always have a backup plan, man. Exactly. As an artist. I was going to get into artist. that in a little bit. Always. Yeah, but that's, gonna, that's a good point. As an artist, you're always supposed to, once you're on, you're supposed to keep that steady and supposed to have a backup plan. If your plan has crumbled, okay, that happens sometimes. Look, the, the greatest millionaires went bankrupt before. Yeah, yeah. But they were able to bounce back. Bounce back. You know, you got to have that backup plan. You got to know that you're in the industry now. You have to make music forever. Think about this for a second. I believe hip hop artists, or any type of rappers or whatever, are the only people that are, that are sort of in the stigma of once you get old, you can't make music no more. You know, like you're an old rapper, like that's dead. Nah, bro. Other genres, there's rock and roll artists or, or rock and roll bands that are still getting deals to this day. And they're 60, 70 years old making money. Yeah, you know, going R&B back people. Going touring and everything. Yeah, going to touring. R&B people too. Like, so so this, as, a, as a hip hop artist, you're still able to make music. I don't care how old you are, bro. You should just, keep going. I just think that don't try to keep up with the generation ahead of you. Right. Stay within your genre and, and, and your generation and try try to, how do you say, blend in with 
Whatever. Try to stay current. Stay current. Stay and, current, and, but stay true to you. But stay true to you. Like and a be, Nas, like a Jay Z. Just you know. Remember, you always gonna have your fans. Once you made those fans, those if you ain't do nothing to lose those fans, those fans are gonna remain. Are they? They gonna the be the rest of your life. Yeah. If Genuine drops something right now, Facts. I'm gonna go see. Perfect to it. example. It's R and B because that's my guy. Right. Right. You right. Know what I mean, so for example, Method Man drops something right now, I'm gonna go listen to it. The locks. Right. Locks to this day, I feel like they still the hardest rappers Yo, out there. Yo, that's crazy. I was just thinking of the locks. I was thinking of Style P or whatever you choose a, a pound of weed, four guns, and a liter of booze. booze. SP <laughs> flows like no nigga. 26, but I'm a oh, old. Yo, Yo, come on, bro. Yo, like that. You, I, yeah. It's, 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 it's like. I feel like Shouts I, to I, shout, my, my, my bad. Shouts to Styles P, man, from why yo, Yonkers, they 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 mess with his heavy goo yeah. So shouts to, you know, he he's a he's a businessman. He has four juice bars right now in Yonkers. He's making Thanks. moves, man. So shouts to Styles P, man. Rough riders, let's it's, get money. Exactly. To the top. You see what I mean? Look, he had backup plans. Still backup plan. making moves. Pla uh, facts, so, facts, yeah. You know what I mean? That's what that's what it's all about, man. Planning ahead. Don't just Right. Think okay, I'm gonna do music and that's gonna be good for the rest of my life. That's not nah, enough. Nah, it's not enough, man. Yeah. If you're gonna get into this industry, make sure you have a backup plan or something printed down, written down. Like yeah. that's that, gonna keep you making. Even you money. if you can't get it started, you might have somebody in your circle that can get it started for you. Right, so right. Push, man. Push. Don't push, ever man. stop. Don't ever stop, man. Great point, man. Great point. So yeah, to finish up that with Hurricane Chris. So he got caught up, you know, and and he made moves, man. He he had some music that was official. He had Players Rock. Yeah, you know something that he uh, that he did for uh, Holly Bar uh, for which appeared on his first LP. Holly Barry, she's fine, you know. So he he was making moves, man. He nice. he had official official music, and he tried to keep up. You know, he came out, his latest joint, uh, King Kane, came out in 2017. He tried to keep up, but uh, understand this, when it comes to keeping up, especially nowadays, you have to um, be sort of seen more. You, where's your video? I haven't seen a video from him in mad long. Yeah, That's yeah. how you stay current. You you come out with new content, but you also have to know how to promote and market that. Because what I think happens, you you become now uh, um, to the labels and all the bigger companies that gave you a chance before, you become sort of like... Uh, you fly under the radar to the newer talent that's out right now, to the people that, that that's coming out that's fire. Because exactly. labels, bigger labels, bro, they're not worried about smaller people in the market. I mean, not, nah, not smaller, nah. but older people in the market. They're not worried about anybody that's already made them money. They want them, they want fresh talent. Look at us as PMG LLC, Pilot, I mean, Pilot Music Group LLC, which is under PMG LLC. We're looking for fresh talent all the time. You know, we, we would rather look for that, for that, um, current sound or what's out now as a label as a label that's what you look for yeah. you know as the promoter and also my says the A&R and Ladama O shouts to Ladama O behind the camera this week man she's always holding it holding it up you know appreciate your um, hard you can, work and dedication yeah. facts you can follow on, on, on Instagram Ladama O just like that you can also follow the promoter uh, hookah the movement hookah the movement always with a hookah, hookah. you don't see always the hookah the hand hookah. <laughs> follow also Mach RCG you know on Instagram and it's the pilot I-T-S-D-A-P-I-L-O-T -I on Instagram but you know I, I think that um like us, like I just said, as a label, we always look for that current talent. But here's where you have to separate it as an artist. You have to stay current and come up with content and come up with things that that make you um, appealing to the public or your fans right now. That's how you stay current. Prime you know? example, Will Smith. Will Smith. Great example. Great example. And let's not let's not try to bank off or ride off the fact that Jordan Lucas just made this crazy, amazing track oh, and, and put Will Smith. Will that Smith has hits, with, bro. Will. Oh, yeah, the remix, though. I played it Official. on the Flight Zone one week, yeah. Official. Facts. So, Will Smith over a period, great example, cool about Will Smith over a period of time was able to stay afloat and in a different way. And to He's, change generation, uh, Bad Bunny, look at how he mixes it up. Of course, you have to true. bring Bad Bunny up. This guy. He stays true. He stays true. <laughs> That's to, the homie, cool. To, to his art. Chambea, chambea, chambea. Every time I see this guy, cool. He's but, playing. That's but you homie. get what I'm trying to say? Though? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I get it. I, mean? I like, get it. He'll go. He goes anywhere from hard to soft. Right. He'll make songs for transgender, whatever the case may be. This yeah. guy stays true. Whatever to keeps himself him current. Yeah. And stays busy. Right. So it's the same thing for any upcoming artist. Stay busy. Right. Mix it up. Don't be afraid to try new things, man. Because when you're afraid to try something, that might that next person might take your idea and exactly. you just missed out on, it on might an be, opportunity. It might be way too late. Exactly. Great point. Might be way too late. You have to seize the moment, capture it now. And that's how we move. PMG LLC, that's how we move. You know, when we promote, when we do things, we grasp the, the, the attention of the audience. We go hard. Bang! You know, and we give you whatever we have. 
You know, we don't overdo it the way we do. You know, we don't overdo it because I think, in my opinion, that if you overdo it, people are going to start, ah, look oh, at this guy. Chasing. You know, this. Yeah, 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 chasing. Nah, we, we don't do that. Facts, we, facts. We just us. I mean, people are going to have their opinion. Reg- yeah, we're just us. People are going to have their opinion regardless. So uh, you should never, ever consider anybody a criticism to be harsh on yourself or, or to be like, ah, oh, man, whatever. It's positive criticism out there, but there's going to be haters is what I'm trying yeah. to say. So and don't the, take that and be like, oh, and man. And this message doesn't just go to artists. You know, there's people, you, yeah. there, there's different Everybody. kind of artists. Artists. I'm talking about people that sew and print shirts and, right, 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 and right. things like that. You know, we got a lot shirts, of those. Speaking of shirts, my bad. I'm going to cut you off for one second. Kings County Media. Shouts to Jazzo. Get up on that one, bro. Just to yeah. give him a little bit. Just to give him a little bit, man. Shouts to Jazzo. The album, you know, we were, we were invited. Like Dama O and I were invited to uh, to the warm up. Yeah, facts, man. It's all love. Baby. It's all love. King County Media, man, all the way from New York. Shouts to Jazzo. You know, he struck a deal with Jay Z with Rock Nation. You know, we was we were we were uh, fortunate enough. I don't like to say lucky. You know, we don't bank on luck, but uh, we were fortunate enough to be in, uh, a part of his um, album release party. The warm up. Go get that. Go grab that. Go download it. Go stream it right now. The warm up. You know, it's on all platforms by Jazzo. He's the originator, OG. And yo, Kuwa, that day to me was the most memorable day in hip hop. I seen. I seen you had your little man's with That's you too. Exactly. Jason. Exactly why, bro. My son got to meet Jazzo. A lot of people in this generation, even my son's generation, you know, they don't they don't know who Jazzo is. Honestly, it's, it was almost because he was able to stay current and stay relevant, you know. But it was almost overshadowed for, for the type of music that shifted, the hip hop shifted into. It was hard, you know. Look at Nas. Nas is an amazing artist. He's still put on to this day. But hip hop shifted, and those type of artists were put on the back burner, mainstream wise, and, and on the radio and things of that. Nature. Artists work back and working back doors, like they work. Oh yeah, behind the they scene. get money. Yeah. So while y'all think that they're completely done, nah, they ain't. Completely Listen, Jazzo done. started as a, as a producer. I didn't know that. I, we we uh, another thing we were able to interview him the next day after that. Shouts to Jazzo oh, yes, uh, up in the uh, ride along at the ride along. I seen it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shouts to Kings County Media. Shouts to the ride along. Shouts to Rough Riders. Shouts to Miss Info Ran. Everybody up there in New York. We were able. Listen, we were invited to real quick, and then you get back to your point. We were invited to the warm up the, the album release party, right? And Tupac's uh, uh, and Biggie's old studio. Remember where Tupac yeah, got yeah, shot yeah. at? Bro, I was right there. I felt the energy there in that whole studio. So we were invited there, which was amazing, you know, and, and I don't like name dropping, but every OG celebrity or younger celebrity that were, you know, that's a part of the hip hop that, that knows jazz or like that, that mess with Rock Nation, shouts to Tidal, they, they, you know, they sponsored yeah. the joint Deuce A, sponsored it, you know, Equity Distribution sponsored it, and King County Media, obviously, you know, uh, and Come Clean as well. Um, but it, it, it was just that feel of being within the industry and, and, and putting on for PMG LLC yeah, yeah. As, as executives, bro. It felt good to, to be there for to our make company. A move. Yeah, power move. Power like move. I was saying. Yeah, power moves, bro. So that was love, you know. And, and then the next day, you know, Miss Info, like I said, shouts to Miss Info. While we were at the, uh, the, at the, at the um, album release party, she was like, You guys want to interview Jazz O tomorrow on the ride along? You know, it was Friday the next day. The day that day was a Thursday. Yeah, yeah. So the next day was Friday. You know, ride along comes on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And then Saturday, she does the mix. I looked at Ladama, like, oh, you know, at the executive manager, I'm like, we don't even need to answer it. Yes, we'll be there. You know, yeah, don't nice. even think twice. We're going to be there. Jazz O, the originator, bro. So that was a great moment with, uh, within. And then I just so happened, my first time bringing the son, my son up to the, uh, to, the, to the station, the Rough Rider station, you know, Jazz O put on, man, and, and, and my son got to meet him. So to, to, to make that point clear and to go back to it, I was able to bring my son within to hip hop, to that, like the OG was passing down that, that hip hop, you know, culture to my son, bro. And he shook his hand. I got a picture of him. You look yeah, on, on my, yeah, yeah, bro. Guys, I know you've seen it, but I'm just saying mean? to the public. Log on to his Facebook or um, IG. It's the pilot.com. I mean, it's the pilot. <laughs> Yo, it's coming soon. It's going right to come soon, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah I, I let it one. out too early. My yeah. bad. <laughs> but uh, it's the pilot on Facebook. On Instagram. Um, and on Instagram. So yeah. go check it out. Yeah, that was a great picture. And he got, you know, he got pictures of a lot of, a lot of great memories on there, too, you know? Yeah, man. Official, official, man. Official. So, yeah, so yeah, going back, let me close out with Hurricane Chris, then I'll go back to your point. So he was, uh, uh, he's locked up right now, man. Hurricane Chris, bro. You know, I, I mean, it, it comes a time as an artist or somebody that's in the industry, like I was saying earlier, where you have to look at your career and, and, and be like, yo, I got to make, I got to do this move. I got to do that move to stay current, to make money. Because this is what it's about. You don't have a day job. You're not working as a trucker. You're not working as a person in the hospital or anything like that right now. That you, that, that, that you can make money off of. It's all about making bread, Kuba. Yeah. No matter what you do in life, it's about making money. And you got to move different. All eyes Facts. on you. Move different. It's on the shirt. I move different. Yeah. Shouts to Jazzo. Right on the side. Right on the side. Kuba just got this shirt today, man. Shouts to <laughs> that's what they homie. You've been holding it for me. Yeah, I've been holding that shirt holding for him, man. Me, so. Let's get money. But yeah, man. Um, so you got to stay, in my opinion, you got to stay relevant. You got to stay current. So 
He he did that up to 2017. I don't think he did it. He, he, he's, his style is different. His whole movement is different. So I don't want to um, criticize that in a negative way. Don't get me wrong. But I, I would think to you, you have to manage yourself at a certain point when you become an artist that's been around a lot. You have to invest in yourself. You have to put money up for yourself. Yeah, it's almost like Cuba. It's almost like back to what you were when you first started. Facts, because man. as I said earlier, these labels, these big labels are looking for that new talent. They want that fresh, 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 fresh talent. So if you don't get that, you know, it's almost like you got to do it yourself. I mean, I mean, the, 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 the labels looking at you like you got to do it yourself because we put up for you already. You know, all that money that we invested in you. Now it's time for you to put up for yourself. So he I don't think he was able to do that because honestly, if you ask anybody from this generation, they don't know who Hurricane Chris is. So right now he's locked up on charges. You know, we're gonna keep y'all updated as we get more information on it. But he's locked up on murder. He shot this dude that tried to steal the stolen car. Supposedly. That tried to steal his stolen car, supposedly. allegedly. You know, and 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 you know we don't notice the media, huh? some, media sometimes screws screws. Yeah, the they, story they, they screw so. it. I mean, we get our we get our news from 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 uh, great sources from from you know uh, official sources, but you know the point is, as an artist, as a person that's in the industry, you can't be putting yourself in these situations, bro. You already are established as an artist. You already have become someone that other people look up to. You are a person that 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 other people want to be like, in a sense. Yeah. Come on, let's keep yeah. it funky. Yeah. And if you're putting yourself in these situations, you're doing these things like that, you messed your whole career up, now it's like, you're done. Now people are looking at you like, hey, you're worse than us. Yeah. You yeah. feel and me? And with so, everything going on, man, this, this is something that we did not need, because you know, right. you're out there, you're mainstream. Right, right, right. So come on, guys, let's keep our heads in a... Um, Let's keep our heads together out there, yo. Facts, man. Let's keep working. All right, so let, let, let me go back real quick. Because you talked about Chief Keith. What did you have on Chief Keith behind, besides him having your hat on? What, what was up? What, 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 that, what, what brought that up? What brought that to your attention? What, Chief about Keith? the hat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. About the hat. Uh, I seen. I was, on, uh, I was on a website looking at it. On hip hop? Hip hop what? Hip hop. Hip hop DX. Hip hop. But what were so, they talking about? What was the thread about? Uh, and then, and when you, it, uh, you get I'm back on. to it. But Major Key Podcast, as I said, you can download the Podbean app. It's available on all platforms. You know, um, also, on, like he's saying, on. on um, it's available on Apple at the Apple Store and it's available on, on Google Play. But like at school, I was saying, we're also on Spotify. Coming this week, we're coming on um on, on Apple Podcasts and we're coming on Google Podcasts and all the podcasts. Wherever you listen to your podcast, you listen to Major Key Podcasts. We're not playing any games. Also, every Tuesday between 8 and 9 p.m., make sure you download the Rough Rider Radio app. You know, catch the flight zone. It's the flight zone. It's to the top. Ain't no coming down. It's the pilot. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's get it's money, your man. boy. We out here, baby. Yeah, man. Shouts to Mach. He always has this segment talking hip-hop with Mach. And you know what? He started with, about like four weeks ago. You know, around the time Fred the Godson had passed, R.P. Fred the Godson, or five weeks ago now. Damn, it's been that, damn, that it's time passes, that. bro. Bro, and when I tell you, man, I did not know about Fred the Godson until right. this happened. And yeah, the, man. The he was, was a beat. savage, What? Bro. Yeah, you, you, you wasn't listening to Fred like that back then? Nah, Back I with, yo, I, I, bro, I, I like I heard the name around, but I didn't, you know, I didn't, I didn't know he was writing for people. And yo, Fred was making moves, down, and look, like Jada Kiss said, dead rappers get better promotion. Going back to the locks, and you know, again, yeah, rap. facts, <laughs> yo, because like you, you, you didn't listen to him until his whole thing happened with the coronavirus, right? But now you're going back to his old work. Now, as I said, Dead Rabbit gets better promotion. Now, that happening to him, it almost promoted him and now, you know, his family is able to reap the more benefits because he was all, they were already reaping the benefit. He was on, bro. There's a lot of rappers out here like that, bro. Look at PMG LLC. We're making money. We're making moves and we're not on the radio. I mean, we're on the radio, but we're not on, on like you turn the dial on and you hear us on the weekend top 30. That's all right. I'm cool with that. You know, you haven't heard that hit, that, that worldwide hit yet. That everybody recognizes as a hit. They be on the Grammy list as a nomination or anything like that. That's fine. I'm cool with that because I'm on God's time. That's gonna work soon. It's gonna work towards that. It's gonna come to that. But I ain't, I ain't worried about that right now. You know. But Fred the Godson, Kuba, Fred was there, bro. And he was he had a lot of ties to um to Rough Rider Radio when he first yeah. started. He had a song. Remember, I played it on the Flight Zone with Styles P. Official yeah. track, bro. You know, yeah. move, a little, track I that, move that, a little different. I move a little different. Album that Style P just dropped. There's this track on there. It's fire, man. I, I should have got the name of that, man. I was just. It's cool. We'll find it. it. We're gonna we'll take a little it. break in a little bit. You know, we're gonna yeah. we're gonna get into some music and stuff. We'll find it. We'll come back on that. You know, in yeah, about so, five minutes or so. so I die my always telling me five minutes, five minutes. So, <laughs> I'm over here on the hip hop DX and I'm right. read, I'm reading on this Chief Keith stuff. So All right, what you got for me? On a day intended to celebrate freedom, the family and friends of Trey Savage are mourning a loss. According to TMZ, the 26-year-old rapper was shot and killed on the south side of Chicago on Friday, June 19th. Wow. Really? On June of, Man, on June on, 10th. Man. June 10th, bro. So around 11 a.m. local time after he just dropped 
off his girlfriend, Savage, who was signed to Fredo Santana and Chiefs Keeps label, right. Glory Boys Entertainment. Glow Boys, report- Glow Boys. Is it Glory it Boys or Glow Boys? Glory Boys. Oh, glow- okay, but they yeah. say Glow Boys. Yeah, okay, okay. Glow Boys, yeah. Right. Entertainment was reportedly driving through the Ch- Chatham. I can't. I don't, Chatham. What's that? What's that right there? Right here. Chatham. Yeah, yeah, Chatham. Yeah, Chatham, yeah, Chatham yeah, right? Chatham yeah, yeah, neighborhood. Yeah, yeah. When someone opened fire, striking him in the shoulder and neck. Police wow. say Savage's car then slammed into three other vehicles. After yeah, he at that point, was he was hit. already done. Guys, if you guys want to go on there, there's a video showing some stuff. I'm pretty sure they can't get the whole. The, the yeah, whole they ain't got all the footage. Yeah, but you know it's on there. So, what, what website is that so the people know? It's Hip Hop DX. Guys. Shout out to Hip Hop DX. Yeah. Not, yeah, that's a credible org. website. Yeah, it's a credible website. Yeah. You know, you get some good news on there. Hip Hop DX. But well, he was wow. rushed to the hospital. He was rushed to the hospital, and um, he still died. Unfortunately, you know what I mean. My on June 10th, like family. you just said, bro. My condolences Come on. to the family. Yeah, yeah. And um, you know, prayers go out to everybody out there. That's going yeah, condolences, little, man. Damn, but, um, bro. See, we See don't need happens. that in hip hop, especially around this time. Okay, that's a, you know what? That's a great transition, man. We're gonna come back after we play his, the cat. Now nah, you know what? I was gonna say the captain. We could close out with the captain. His, um, his name was Ken Trey Young. Ken Trey Young. Savage wow. His name is Ken Trey Young. So this was wow. one of his artists. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's crazy, man. But speaking of that, because you just said it happened on Juneteenth, we're gonna take a quick break in the mission. You know, we're gonna get into for the money. I was gonna say the captain, but for the money, we're, we're, it's about for the money right now. It's yeah, always for the it's money. Always for the money. But right now. We're, we're, we're going to shoot the video for Foot of Money. We took some shots the other day at the Flight Zone, you know, and it's, it's going to be dropping soon. This is the project that we're really, really working on right now. So I want you all to catch up to speed with it. For the Money, we're going to take a quick intermission. Check this uh, track out. It's streaming on all platforms right now. Go get that. Go grab that. Go download it. Go stream it. Let's get money. It's to the top. You know who it is. It's the pilot. Ain't no coming down, Kuba. Right after that, we're going to come back, and I want to get into this stuff because you brought up a point to me earlier, bro, and we're going to talk about these alleged lynchings that we don't know where they're coming from yeah, I in just, Cali. Because I, I, so, you, you're talking about Juneteenth and this happening to you know Chief to the homie. So we're going to get back into that. We're going to get into that now after we come back after this little break. Facebook Live, we love you, man. We ain't going to give you the whole episode on Facebook Live. You got to download the Podbean app. Go get that. Also, who about where else? Spotify? Spotify, We're baby. on Spotify. It'll be on Apple Podcasts pretty this, soon. This week coming to Apple Podcasts, and also we're going to do Google Podcasts so, and other 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 podcast platforms. Let's get money. It's to the top. You know who it is. It's the yeah. pilot. It's Kuba. Y'all like the merch? Reach out to Let's get it. O. Yeah, facts. We'll get it done. Yo, that's a quick, real quick, that's a quick transition. This is why I love these guys and the people that I keep around me, they're up to speed and they're doing what, what I would have in mind to do. Now, if you want some type of sponsorship on this table, if you want to be just like the Rough Rider Cup, Kings County Media, PMG LLC, Pilot Music Group LLC, you know, we got merch. Hookah you know, companies. Hookah companies. Whatever you need on this table to sponsor and promote your company or your entity, you can be an artist and you want me to have something on the table that shows who you are. Let's get money, man. It's to the top. Holla at La Dama O. You can follow also on, on Facebook because you're on Facebook right now, Facebook Live. Um, Olga Rivera. Let's get money. O, o Rivera 1011 on gmail.com. Send her your email. Send her whatever you need sponsored on this table and we'll get money together. It's to the top. Ain't no coming down. And guys, make sure you have your information correct. Right, right. We don't want Always. the back and forth. Be professional. Have yeah. everything correct and come legit. If you're ready to do make power moves, make yeah. moves and promote your stuff, Come correct. Yeah, because we don't, correct. Don't, don't, come, don't come halfway because when you come to us, we're ready to make that move for you. Right away. Right away. Ain't You're no not going to be waiting no month for two. No, right away we're making that move. So come correct. Yeah, shouts to Little Roddy because you know, speaking of that, he came at just like that. Little Roddy seen the billboard and he was like, yo, how do I get one of those billboards for my albums and for me? I was like, listen, all I need is detail and location. Right away, 317 Marketing and Media, which La Dama O is the executive marketing specialist for that company, You know, she was able to make power moves. Within a couple hours, it was already done, but he wanted it on a specific day, so we had to wait for that day. Let's get money. It's to the top. Ain't no coming down. Yo, Facebook Live, we love you. Kuba. It's your boy. We're going to we keep going. Here. As I Woo. said, we're going to take a quick intermission and play for the money, which is on all platforms right now. A video coming soon. Let's get this to the top. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Now, yeah. yeah. what you thought it was over? Shit, I'm just barely getting started. It's the pilot. I always had all the patience. Cause I knew my time was coming. Where I'm from, you don't say shit. You just do it for the money. 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 It's the pilot. Real shit I had. 
had the block jump And I had the baddest bitches sucking Ran through them all, no saving nothing Ain't no double nigga, I ain't stuntin' If you wanna come and get a bitch Never flop, I'll make a nigga flip Grab the clutch, she smoking on the stick I got the four on me and it's fantastic Ain't no time to waste, give it to me now Belly of the beast, and I'm on the prowl It's a flagrant, you know a nigga foul If you cross the line, then it's man down I always had all the patience Cause I knew my time was coming Where I'm from, you don't say shit You just do it for the money, it's the pilot Tatted fresh about the voodoo shop That's my homie saying dirty, keep the ink on lock I'll be back to check you, I need my skin itching Gotta get some ill shit, it's already written Stress kills, that's why I smoke the paint away And I hope to God to see another day If I don't, then fuck it I guess I wasn't really that lucky Real rap, I had them niggas shooting at me And now I got your BDS looking at me Stay focused, maintain, cause this shit is real I just do it on my own, man, fuck a deal I always had all the patience Cause I knew my time was coming Where I'm from, you don't say shit You just do it for the money, it's the pilot I just do it for the guap And take minds off the top I wake up to a million dollar dream Back at it, so I guess that I'm a fiend Ain't no other way that I see it fit I want more dough, I'm talking deep dish I grind hard on the daily But keep it brief on the celly Can't trust niggas, so I'm on my own With a bad bitch, fucking in my home On my way up, so I stay up You a light nigga, get your weight up I always had all the patience Cause I knew my time was coming Yeah, yeah, we back, man. Yo, that was for the money streaming on all platforms right now. Go get that, go grab that, go download it, go stream it, Kuba. Ain't no coming down. Double salute on that, man. Let's your money. boy. We here. So yeah, like I said, man, that was for the money, man. Official track, man. Like, you know, I always put on, man. Let's get money. Yeah, we facts, we go. <laughs> yeah, so it's a topic that I wanted to bring up. Let me take a uh swig of this real quick because Take a swig of that. You know, it's a little hard. <laughs> it's a little it's a little hard to bear with. You guys <clears> see the cup, man. If you guys want one. You know, reach out to the Dama O. Oh. Yeah, factual. Yeah, yeah, PMG. All merchandise, uh, Kuba, all PMG LLC merchandise or Pilot Music Group LLC merchandise is available. You know, reach out, like Kuba said, reach out to La Dama O, oh, executive manager for uh, PMG LLC, and we get it done for you. Let's get it. So, um, uh, we're coming back strong with a topic that's really, really, um, you know, it's it's really hard on a lot of people and hard on us, right. ourselves. So, right before know, the break, we talked, we, we said we was going to get into it. Yeah. We was going to get into it. So, um, I wanted to talk about this lynching that's going on, and they're Man. calling it suicides. Whoa. Um, you're telling me out of all these years, now we're starting to decide to hang ourselves? That's, you know, do you agree with that? Man, bro. I, I, first and foremost, man, these things have happened. These lynchings, Cuba, after George Floyd, bro. So they're recent. They're recent. There's six of them. And we got a lot of hate crimes and a lot of hatred going on right now. A lot of negative um, vibes in the world right now, and, and negative movements and things like that. And, and it's just I just don't agree that they're suicides. And this is where we come to. First and foremost, where where are these lynchings happening? At? Like, where, well, where, we, got we got some happening over in um, Texas. We got one California, a few in California, right? Um, New York City. Wow. You know, Oakland, Port, Portland, Oregon, Oregon. In or Oregon, in Oregon. In Oregon. So, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, you got a 17 year old African American boy hanging from a tree in an outside elementary of elementary school, school. Yeah. playground. What? Come on, bro. In Spring, Texas. Bro, that, that just. It's not making sense. It's not making sense to me. You, you guys know how corrupt some of this, some of these government officials are and how. Right how they twist things up and how we can pressure you into doing things and 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 you know they can probably do it in 
push them there. Now they're saying that they got CC videos, and nah, I don't want to hear like them that. doing it of of one of the video, one of the guy um, gentlemen's doing it. And I'm getting this information, a lot of this information from the democracynow.org. Right, right, right. You know, so, so according to their report, this is what they have for you. Exactly. So you know, right. hey, to our fans, people following, if you guys want to talk to us, you guys got more information. If you guys right. want to reach out to us, go on Podbean Podcast. Right. You know, and, and let us know. Spotify, you can listen to it. Yeah. Um, Apple you can leave Music. comments on there. Let us know what you yeah. think about each episode. Go out. Let, episode. let us know. Have a little input, you know, and, and, and interact with us. You know, that's yeah. what we're here for. So, yeah. You know, perfect, there's there's all point. types of ways you can reach out to us, but we prefer on a, this uh, on, platform. Uh, on this platform to right. reach out to us on the Podbean podcast so we can talk about it and we right. can get more deep into it. We'll get back to you. We and answer we'll everybody. You. you know, we, we also uh, the the videos that we had because we it's not just an audio podcast. We do video podcasts. It's available on Pilot Music Group LLC on YouTube. You know, you can also see all the other content that we have on there. Pilot Music Group LLC on YouTube. The videos that we have for the Podbean. You know, you can also interact with us there. Leave us comments. But going back to this, you know, this hanging man. This is not cool. Six people of color of color. Dis- and, and 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 to say, us Spanish people, you're Cuban, I'm Dominican. You know, we have La Dama, who's Puerto Rican, and also uh, Mats, he's Puerto Rican, Puerto Rican, holding down for PMG LLC. You know, we we all have we're African descent. So you know, of color, obviously, it means you know some type of African descent. It, it also Hispanics. It, yeah. It's blacks and Hispanic that have been found. Come on, and, Americans. And, and, and I've been, been doing found. my research. We all have. African American oh, blood yeah. in us. Absolutely. No what do you think? First white. and foremost, you gotta look look at the color. There's no denying or negating the color and even, in us. And and not just the color, but it's just in our bloodstream, it's in right. our bloodline. So even even people that look white and, and, and their skin is that white, right. you still have African American in you. I've oh. been watching and reading and doing my research and do right. your research if you don't think you do. Listen, bro, I have cousins that have blonde hair, blue eyes, and green eyes, and they're Dominican. Yeah. You know, and look at me. I'm not super dark. I'm, I would say like brown skin, I guess. You know, but it, that's to say that, like to your point, even if you look white, you still have African in you. We come from there. That's the, they call it the motherland for a reason. We come from there. It all stems back to Africa. You know, exactly. so but with these with these hangings like you're like you brought up, bro, this is not cool. You know, during the uh, the, the, the racial tension that, that, that's, that's festering over the wake of uh, George Floyd, we're dealing with lynchings, bro. This is not even like I was speaking to Ladama O about this topic, you know, when we first found out. It, 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 we wouldn't say it's a modern day lynching. No, this is an actual lynching, Cuba. Exactly. It's, it's, They're it's, hanging us from trees, bro, to yeah, prove a point. too far now. They're way too, they've been too far, but too, now it's almost, far. I think they're trying to mock us. Yeah, I think they're us. mocking us to say, look, you guys are protesting, you guys are doing this, you guys are doing that, but guess what? We're still going to do this. Yeah, We're and, still going to hang you from trees, bro. That's so, not cool. So, so what I'm saying here is, look, listen, together, united, this is what we are. We're power, strong. Power. You can't break us, all right? We will not be defeated. We will not be hushed. We will not be silent. We're going to keep coming strong. Right. And guys, let's keep it as peaceful as we can and keep pushing forward I mean, and, but Cuba, and making this happen. I understand that point, but how peaceful can you be, bro? No, how no. peaceful can you be when this is, look, they're slapping us in the face and telling us, we're going to hang you from a tree. These are not suicides. Let's keep it real and let's keep it funky for a second. These are not suicides because in history, throughout history, a person that commits suicide is not going to publicly hang themselves. They might jump out of a building. They might do things of that nature to just wipe themselves out. Private. Usually it's a private place within your house or it's somewhere where like, you know, it's not a like you don't want people to and discover let's keep you. It funky. There's let's people that hang real. themselves. My bad. No, people that hang themselves, but in their house, it's nobody hanging themselves from trees, bro. Yeah. And let's keep it funky. Come on. Really? African American hanging himself publicly like that? Right. Since when? Since when? You rarely hear of black people or Hispanics killing themselves in that manner. Right. It's very rare. And suicide goes and within suicide, every race, it, but, it, but it's, it's rare to see that. In this level. This right. This type of level. So At this time. At this time, on top of that. A woman, four men, and a teenage boy, boy bro. Right. They've been found dead in separate hangings. And like Cuba was saying and earlier, it, Portland, it, Oregon, South California, Houston, and New York City, bro. Come on. And it looks like it's moving from state to state. According, it's starting to travel. It's right. not just all happening in yeah, one bro. state. It's and, starting to travel. It's like, it's, they're making it, it's like a, yes. it's, it's like a it's game a state, to them. Yes, yes. Like, And that, that was according to the Herald, you know, the Herald Media, Cuba, which I, you know, I'm looking at as, because as, you brought it up and I had to do a little, you know, dig in. And, and it's like, 
it's almost like I said, it's a slap in the face. It's like, yo, we're doing yeah, this, and what y'all going to do to stop us? And like you said just now, it's moving from state to state. Yeah, it's just, just going too far. They're, they're doing way too much. And, you know, it's like a wave, man. It's like a tidal wave of, of, right. of hate. And you guys are not going to break us. And, and one message that I have, you know, listen. Those of you out there that are protesting, that right. are in those towns, it, it, it don't even matter if you're in those towns or not. If you got kids and you're letting your kids go out, your wives working late, let's. We got to be united. You got to keep an eye on each other. We got to right. support each Check other. Check up on them. Check up on them. Make sure you're on top of them because they're only doing this to people that they're catching alone. Right. Vulnerable uh, victims. Vulnerable. So yeah. you know, start teaching your kids how to defend themselves. How to yeah. how to like get Cuba. out of those Cuba's situations. Like a, a, a karate master. What? Well, not a master, <laughs> but you know, I, I I'm I'm you know very well trained and I'm right. very well educated in the martial arts. So right, right. You know, I, I do teach my kids. But I right to your point, though, you got to take care of your family. You got to you show got them to. what you show know, them. or if not, incorporate some type of um, classes for them. Some, some type know? of self defense training or some type of mac, yeah. some type of develop uh, develop something in them where they can help themselves or others if they're in danger. Right. Don't Great just keep point. sending them out to this world and they don't know anything. Yeah, because people have to work. People have to go out. People have yeah. to work. And, and then, unfortunately, there's a lot of people out there that are defenseless. They're the people that, that, that can't fend for themselves. They can't fend. You know, they can't fight off any type of, you know, anything that comes at them that's negative. You know, and, and, and people prey on people like they, that. They there's opportunities. It. Yeah, there's opportunities that, that, that they just wait on, as you just said, to catch you at the wrong moment. They catch you slipping. Bro, you're done. What you going to do? You know, yeah. and in my opinion, not not, but but this, this is the thing about these hanging things, they they supposed evidence of no foul play. You know, people that like you said earlier, videos of of, of them doing it themselves. You know, this I, I don't know, it's, man. This is too too. It's, it's, it's too so much many, coincidence for it's me. Too much coincidence, and it's just too. They have too too many loopholes. Right. Like like there there's ways around stuff. You know, I I we know. Here's the We're thing. We're not stupid. We're no. We know yeah. that. They know how to cover up shit. How Absolutely, to set people up. How to how you say frame people? Frame people. Yeah, so, it happened on. through history. It's, but here's the thing, Kuba. We were talking about multiple people hanging from trees across America during the middle of a race war. That's what we would say, race war. And as we said on the podcast, on the previous uh, um, episode of the podcast, we're on podcast now. Uh, to me, as the point that I brought up is, is not white and black or brown, whatever. To me, it's blue against humanity. It's like almost like it's a, it's a race war um, or, or color war between, between the, uh, the, 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 the cops or, or the, the, the law enforcement and us. And us. You know, and they're I, turning it. They're trying to turn this into a a race war, into a race war. Right. That's and, what they're publicly trying to say to make us to feud something else. And 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 listen, my hat goes off. I don't have one on now, but if I did, it goes off. <laughs> I'll take mine's off. Might not. No, I'm not gonna take mine. It's a pilot right now because yeah. of headphones. But listen, <laughs> for those of you that are staying level headed and moving, powerful and, and strong, and making these power moves to try and create change, thank you. Right. Thank you. But at the same time, I don't fault those that are fighting back the same way they're fighting yeah. with us. Because enough is enough, Kuba. It's, enough is enough. Get tired, man. There's a time where you just, like you said, you're tired. Just think about it. When you work all day or you do whatever you do all day, your body's like, oh, I'm tired. I got to shut down. I had enough of this. No matter what it is, I'm putting it down. This is how this situation is going now. This is where, where we're at. Us as minorities, and, and as I said before, we're becoming the majority or we have become the majority, but systematically and mentally, we still think like we're the majority. I'm in the minority. The minority. We're not. We're not. We're Honestly, not. we're not. We have become the majority, but we have to start thinking like the majority. Like majority. We have to start thinking. And honestly, to, to that point right there, I can have a side point to it because we're all supposed to be equal. There's no there's no majority. There's no minority. There's in between. They try to put a, a, a systematic uh, um, um, status on life, on things that, you know, you either got to pick Democrat, you got to pick Republican. What about the Green Party? What about the third party? Why can't I pick them? You know, you either have to be on this side or that side. No, we all are support. We all bleed red. 
At the end of the day, we all bleed red. Why can't we all just be, you know, equal in a sense? Okay, there's people that are more, uh, I guess, we're intellectual than others. There are people that are in different positions or that are in different places in life, Cuba, exactly. that I would say that, that uh, you have to put on in a different manner. But I shouldn't treat you in a different way because you work at McDonald's and you're in a drive through window. Exactly. You know, I, as a human being, I believe that I should treat you the same whether you're a millionaire or, 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 a, peasant, or a peasant in a sense. And and you no know? one's peasants, you know what I mean. But, yeah, but they they, they look at the us, they look it. up they look at us like that sometimes. Right. But guess what? We're, even even the peasants sometimes become billionaires and millionaires. Absolutely, yeah. It comes out of nowhere. Play, it comes out yeah. of nowhere. It can and I say peasant time. in the sense because that word stems from a person exactly. that doesn't have much. Yeah, have you know, much, in the times yeah. of kings and and queens and things of that nature, the times where they ruled the where there's there's still kings and queens that rule some part, countries and stuff. But all over the world, there used to be kings and queens, not presidents and anything like dictators or anything like that. And, so that's why I say peasants. And, and, but and, and look, look how ridiculous this is getting to the fact. To the point is, I'm 37 years old right now, right, right. and you, you, you salute! Shouts to, to you, man. You made it thirty-seven. Yeah, about to be thirty-eight in a yeah, few, um, next week. Coming up, let's, let's get it. Get it, damn! Your whole June is full of <laughs> surprises, right? bro. That's yo. what's up, man. But, I'm happy uh, for you, bro. And it's crazy because right now, yo, I've been using this syrup for my pancakes for years, <laughs> but now y'all want to remove her face. Whoa, listen! Now y'all want to remove the face real from quick, Uncle Ben's real rice. quick. That is, yo, let's get let's it's get like, money, Cuba, because so, I don't I don't know. We're gonna jump into that real quick. Wow, that's a great transition, man. Only always putting on PMG LC, always in the building. Major key podcast, we always in the building putting on. We're gonna get right into that real quick. We're gonna get into it's the captain, baby. It's the pilot, the captain. New single that just dropped, man. Let's get money. We're gonna shoot this video in about a month after we shoot for the money. But I want y'all to breathe on this track. I always play in the beginning of the episode, but I'm gonna give you the full track today. To the top, Kuba. Let's, Let's get money, get man. Ain't no coming down. Ain't no playing games, man. It's the captain. Breathe Sweet. on this track. We'll be right we back here, after baby. this, man. Yeah. Let's get it. Yo, AP, what they talking about? Huh? Uh, uh, Tell them if ain't buy no money, I don't want to hear about it. No, no. Let them know I got contracts on my desk right now. I do. do. Let's speak money. PMG LLC. I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. No. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no money, get out of my way. I'm the captain. Yeah, yeah. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. No. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no money, get out of my way. Nigga. Be capping, I don't be reacting. You talking that money, I'll tell you what's happening. Yeah. Looking for action, you know what I'm packing. I told her 11, she know I be macking. CEO, it's what they call me now. From the Bronx, so I ask you out. Truth be told, I ain't saying nothing that I ain't live, so you best believe I walk it out. Take it easy, man, I'm the Peter man. Up, up, and away like Peter Pan. I put on for my city, let a couple niggas in. Come to find out, all they did was pretend I get straight to the money. All you do is talk, I'm a fly ass nigga. All you do is walk, I fed you niggas. Gave bread to you niggas, not one phone call, and I did you. You niggas, I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no money, get out of my way. I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no Money, get out of my way. I seen it coming, now I got him running. Huh? I thought you yeah. niggas was gunning. Let me find out you been fronting. I've been a legend in my city. What you talking about? Did it on my own. Yeah, I made it out. Yeah. You don't see me on the street because I'm a businessman. If you ain't talking about no money, where you speaking for? Take a look at me. Tell me what you see. A self made young boss. It's what you niggas want to be. I call the shots. I tell them pull up for the three. Fuck the city up when I pull up in the V. I see them comments, but it's funny to me. Same niggas that be talking, they be walking down the street. When I pull up on the scene, bitches know it's a homicide. They see the drip, they see the sauce when I fly by. I made my for the top. I always had a vision. Do it for my niggas facing life for living. Uh, I swear this can't be real to say I wouldn't make it out. You fell asleep on the mattress, I hit it out. Who you can't know a man, man, I clear it out. Name another nigga like me, that's word of mouth. Or the hate beautified for the jet. Competition is now nah, nah, I'm the best. It's not a joke when your pockets out of shape. That's why I train myself every day to never wait. She told me, baby, don't go. But I told her that I can't not 
understand. I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no money, get out of my way. I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no money, get out of my way. It's the pilot. I told you I don't play no games. It's to the top, ain't no coming down. Let's get money. Yeah, I'm the captain. When I fly by, niggas really know what's happening. No capping. Keep my brim low, got my money up, damn right, no slacking. Hey, what you say? You looking for me? I've been on that road, I'll be back in a wig. You know I don't slay. I'm chasing that pay. You ain't talking no money, get out of my way. Yeah, yeah, that was the captain out on all platforms right now. Go get that, go grab it, go download it, go stream it. You know, I put on, man. That's what I do. It's the captain. Yes, the baby, captain. We're, here. we're still here. When I fly by, it's really know what's happening. No captain. Let's get it, Guwa. Major Key Podcast, man. That's what we do, man. We don't play no games. PMG LLC, man. It's to the top. Let's get it. All right, so yeah, right, right before the break, man, we was talking about this uh, Auntie Mama stuff, man. What you got going on for that? What, what you got for me, Guwa? I want to read a little something on y'all. You know, brace y'all to get y'all to know what she was about and how she um, got into this. Right. But um, before I read this, I want to say I don't agree with what they're trying to do now. Where are you getting this article from? Where, where, um, where? Right now, um, I'm on Syracuse.com news. Okay. So um, th- this is where I'm going to read it from before. But um, you have an article also brought up. Yeah, 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 yeah. This, with a little this is different published. history. Right. And this is published by Fox 29 News. Fox 29 News. Right. So, um, this is not too long, so just bear with me. I'm going to read it real quick. So if you guys want to go on there and look, they got pictures of her with the people that signed her and discovered her. So it's an actual person. For a lot of people that don't know, Aunt your mama that's on a bottle of the syrup, you know, um, it's an actual person. It's not a made up, fictitious, you know, character or whatnot. Yes, yes. So um, here I go. Let me get right into it real quick. Okay. This injustice for me and my family. This is, um, actually, let me go back. Let me read to you who is speaking. Right. This is... Um, and this is Larnell it, Evans Sr., which is her great grandson. Okay. All right. So it's actually a family. It's actually a family. Right. Descendant. Yeah. And um, he's very angry with the situation. With the logo. But with the logo. Uh, with and this is recent. He just, he just, um, of removing it, getting rid of it. Yes. Yes. So he's not with the, uh, the fact that they're getting, you know, they, they're removing it. Yeah. They're not oh, with wow. it. Oh, wow. See, we've that, been, that changes the dynamic of everything yeah, of this whole been, conversation been, right now. We've been using this pancake for years, all types of races, uh, uh, the syrup and the syrup, right. And the box. And, you know, even Uncle Ben's rice and all that with, with, with you know, with the African Americans, you know, the cream yeah. and wheat. What does this have to do with anything? Okay. That's it. It's there. It's established. It's been on the shelves. Right. Leave it alone. Let it keep going. Okay. It's not so changing what, the product. So what? The, what is he suggesting? What? What is he mad about? So, what is he um, saying? I'm, I'm, I skipped a little bit of the beginning of the paragraph because I don't want to hold you on this for too long. So no. this I mean, is, it's cool, man. We all made you keep podcast, Cuba. Facts, we can facts. kick it. Let the people know, man. Let them know. You know what I mean? Let so, them know. So right. uh, um, again, excuse me if I if I screw up some words, but let's get this going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This injustice for me and my family. Period. This is part of my history, Sir Evans said Thursday. Right, the right. racism they talk about using images from slavery that comes from the other side. White people from the other side, white people. Right. This company profits off images of our slavery. And, and this company being Quaker, because Quaker owns Antoine. Quaker, yeah. Right. Quaker Oaks. So now where was I? This company profits off images of our slavery, and their answers is to erase my great grandmother's history. A yeah. black female, it hurts. So this is him expressing he hurt, he's hurting. Evan, this is what he banks on. This is like something he sees his great grandmom every time he sees her on yeah, the he's, proud, he's proud, proud of this. Exactly. You know what I mean? Despite whatever happened, how it went, now he's proud of this. Right. So you know you gotta respect his choices too. You know his pain. Yeah. Evan's great grandmother, Anna Short Harrington portrayed Aunt, Aunt Jemima right, from right. 1935 to 1954 after being discovered by the Quaker Oats Company representatives while cooking pancakes at the 1935 New York State Fair. She was hired as an actress to dress up like Aunt Jemima and travel North America serving pancakes and promoting the brand. 
Harrington, who cooked for the many fraternity houses at Syracuse University and in and is buried in Syracuse, was the third Aunt Jemima, Nancy Green, a former slave. Oh, the third. Hold up, hold up. Stop yeah, right there for a second. Gets a little... Hold up, because now, hold up. While you was talking and you were saying that in the beginning, I was going to ask you, but I didn't want to cut you off. I want to give me the info. Now, when you get to that part, I had to cut you off because now it sounds like a mascot. It's, yeah, exactly. Now it's sounding like she is something, no matter who the person is, they're going to put Aunt Jemima there being a black person, a black lady, a black lady, a black woman that looks to me that she is uh, uh, the, 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 the house person to make it a nice word that they used to use back in the day. She is, to me, she looks like a slave, Kuba. She looks like a slave. And she looks like the slave with the little, you know, headband and everything. And she looks like the, uh, a slave of, of uh, well, in the picture, she doesn't have the headband. The picture that you got up right there, that, is the, that the original Aunt Jemima? This is the original. So it started, her name was Aunt Jemima. And, yeah, uh, no. Um, that's what they called her. But right here, it says Nancy Green, a okay, former because, slave. Right. So so, so her name was Aunt Jemima. The, and the name Aunt Jemima has, now that is, is a whole nother uh, uh uh, uh, um, topic because mm-hmm. the name from, from the article that I'm reading, her name came from a song, bro. Her name came from a song that the owner heard. And he heard, and it's a song about a, 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 a female lady, a, a, a black a female slave, uh, right? A female slave. So now, to me, you're putting is a mascot because you're putting no matter as long as you have a black face. A face of a black woman on your product, and the name ain't your mama, which is stemming from that song. It doesn't matter who it is, because you told me about three people so yeah, far. Yeah, so, people. how many has it been since then? So, right now, her name, the 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 one that the third person that played it, which right. her name is Nancy Green, a former slave, originated the role with an apron and headscarf in nine. In 1893, right? Wow. So, so, so the name, right? For the the the, the brand, uh, um, the brand, and in in, in in the whole, the brand, old Aunt Jemima, which is a song, right? Mm-hmm. A song. So they use Aunt Jemima. The name for the brand came from a song called Old Aunt Jemima. That Rut and Rut being uh the, the founder, which is uh in 19, 8, 1889, Chris Rutt and Charles Underwood. Developed the logo for a, a new ready-made pancake mix, yeah. um, according to the uh, New York Times, right now, here, which I... is called Old Aunt Mama. But the Rut heard the song, right, uh-huh. sung by black face performer, Cuba performer, uh, uh, similar to uh, the headscarf and clothing to which the model used to eventually wear in, in, in the lo- in the logo, which they took off. You know, she doesn't have the headscarf and all that. They yeah. took. You notice they revised the, they the revised logo. Revised the whole logo, right? So, so, so now the history is a little different, bro. Because I swear, I lied to you. Not I thought until recently. I didn't do a lot of research on it. I thought until recently that this lady was at least a person that had something to do directly with the brand. Like she was the the person that came up with the recipe for the pancake mix or something of that nature to be the face. Like let's say like Wendy's or KFC. Those people are the face of their brand. You see their face and those are the owners or somebody correlating straight to the, like like Wendy's is the daughter of the, uh, of the guy that made Wendy's. So now it changes everything, Kuba. It changes the conversation because what you did was, and I understand, listen, there's two perspectives. I understand her grandson because this is what the family has to hang on to, right? And old Aunt Jemima. But, right? And he's, I guess he's the grandson of the latest one? Um, yes. That's okay. what the, the way that they're explaining it, yeah. And, you know, and again, we're going to keep, we're going to talk about this a little more, but if you guys have your opinions, go on Major P, uh, on, Major, on Major uh, on Major Beam co- Podcast. No, no, no. Pod Beam. Pod Beam. But Major Key Podcast Major on Pod We're going to get it right, baby. Let's Pod get it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just got, we got good. so many companies that we mix them exactly. up Exactly. That's so. the thing. That's the thing. But, um, you know, log on. Leave your comments. Talk to us. Let us know. Let us know how you really feel about it. Also this. on Spotify, you know, and then on coming Spotify. soon this week, we're going we're gonna to be on. We want to be three episodes in. So this week, we're going to incorporate Apple and we're going to do our Google podcast. But but going back to this, though, as what I'm thinking is now it changes the the, 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 the mentality and the way you think about um, the Aunt Your Mama pancake. And now, I honestly, I understand her grandson or her great-grandson, but I honestly don't want to see that on there now because to me, it's a mockery of slavery and a mockery of, of Aunt Your Mama, which can from a song that was performed by a black faced person that's racist so to me yes they should take it so off. what do you think so you feel that way because you just learned the history or yes it changed so, my so, perspective so now perspective of the right. picture yeah exactly so what so 
would you feel better if it was a white person on there? No. To me, I want the see it's not it's not about well, face. You get what I'm trying to say now? Yeah, I know, I get it. I get I get the question, but here's 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 how I would answer that. I don't care who it is, as long as this the original person that gave us this product. You know, don't give me a fictitious person because now not only are you giving me a fictitious person, but you're adding some type of racism to it. And that's where it definitely crosses the line yeah, for me. Exactly. Now you're you're making it a black face, but think about it, a black face person performed this and it was a song. Sung some racist, uh, racist song sung yeah. about a black uh, slave lady. Yeah, I feel like the, a, a nice, a nice chunk of change should be cut out to the family. Each family, Each because family, they used a couple. Because they used a couple of them. Give them their money, remove her, and put something positive on there. Right. Something that's not involved with slavery. Now, All right, uh, I don't, I don't you feel know, like I, I really don't agree with you putting any other kind of face on there. Right. If anything, bring. But you know what? They might have done that. Bring Kuba. the same race back. Yeah. They on might. that bottle, because we've been there already. Factual. So don't change it. Factual. So Fact, yeah, you want to okay. bring Beyonce, Rihanna, whatever, I don't care I what get you what do. you're saying. And that aspect, it has history to the black community of being Aunt Your Mama. That's almost like the go-to for the uh, urban and, 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 and the minorities, that Aunt Your Mama, because you feel connection to it, right? But there's not, to me, there's no originality in the history of it. So I think it should be removed, but I understand your point. I, yes. I disagree. I agree to disagree. I understand your point because it's something that's a connection to the black community, but I disagree with the fact that it's on there and I would not want to see it on there because the history now, since I've learned this, the history changes, bro. It changes, yeah. It, it changes, changes a little yeah, bit. Yeah, it changes that's almost, the aspect of what we're watching and what we're eating. And exactly. What we're or the product that I'm consuming. Yeah. So, and, and to your point of the family being compensated, they might have done that already. They might have had a deal Probably, with them yeah. and they would have gave them something just like Gerber does. That Gerber baby is not the original Gerber. That's not the baby that the parents or whoever came up with Gerber, they had this baby and they wanted to put their face on there. You feel me? Gotcha. So it's, it's not the same. But every family that they used for the Gerber baby, they compensated them yeah. for. So I would so, hope that the ancient mama family has been compensated. But, you know, we brought up that subject. And um, like I said, don't hesitate to log on to um, the Podbeam for, for Major Key Podcast. Oh, you definitely got to download Podbeam. You're probably yeah, listening to us it. on Podbeam right now. Exactly. So, you know, get on there, comment, talk to us about it. Everything we've been talking about. Uh, we're going to hop on to the next topic real quick. Facts, man. We got a couple of albums that came out, Cuba. You know, a couple people in the game, they still making noise, man. That's how they do it. Ain't nobody stopping. But before we get into that, we're going to get into, like I said earlier, man, the captain. The captain out on all platforms right now. Go get that. Go grab that. Go download it. Go stream it. You know, I ain't playing no games. When I do this, listen, I'm the face of my label, Pilot Music Group LLC. I'm the face of the label. I have to keep coming out with music, Uba, you know? And, and, and like you were saying earlier, we did- I think heard the second verse, though. How'd it go again? Listen- you got it. Listen, I'm gonna put him on the spot. You put me on the spot. I was spot. listen. I was gonna give it to you, but as a marketing strategist that I am, I'm not gonna give it to you. I'm gonna make you go listen to it. Give me a stream, please. Let me get one. No, I'm not begging, but let me get a stream, homie, and go listen to yeah, it on listen, every platform know right now. Is. Get right with Let's us. Let's get money. Well, listen, going back to the music, A Boogie with the Hoodie came out with something. Zoo Wale. York. Yeah, yeah. Wale. T Grizzly. We talked about that on the flight zone. You know, all, pro all new projects this week, man. We're going to get, like I said, get back into some music stuff, man. That's how we do on, 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 on Major Key Podcast. We give you a little bit of everything. It's not only just topics, political stuff, whatever's going on in the world right now. We're also going to give you music, and we have to give you music. In the height of the protests and everything that's going on right now, Wale, you know, he came out with an EP called uh, Imperfect Storm. You know, the D, uh, DMV rapper announced his new music through social media this Thursday morning, you know, and, and, and the cover art is official. Everything, you know, everything about Wale since he's been down. No, before MMG, Kuba, you know, he, he was already putting on. That's what made Rick Ross sign him, you know, and, yeah. and shouts to Wale. He's always working, Very man. Very intelligent young man. You know? Yeah. You know what I mean? That man right there, I... I, I I mess with Wale. Salute, salute. Salute to Wale. Y'all better be ready, man. A lot of niggas want the fame. want the fame, yeah. But I just want to get paid. Get paid, yeah. I see my ex the other day. I see that hoe. She said, damn, I should've stayed. It's too late, though. 